What does a sunburn have to do with an eagle? Look at that eagle. She's been flying around all day. Where does she get all that energy? We haven't been hiking very long and I'm pooped. These granola bars should help. I wonder what that eagle ate. The eagle might have eaten a snake, which ate a frog, which ate a grasshopper, which ate some grass. Each step is a link in a chain, a food chain. And all those plants get their energy from the source of all food energy on Earth, the sun. Sunlight enters the food chain through plants. Special structures in the leaves of the plant collect sunlight and turn the light energy into food, a process called photosynthesis. The plant then uses the food, along with water and nutrients from its roots, to grow. Some plants, like the Venus flytrap, are able to capture and eat insects to get extra nutrients. The Venus flytrap lures flies and other insects to its trap with a sweet smelling nectar. If the insect touches trigger hairs on the inside of the trap, it snaps closed. The closed trap then fills with juices that digest the insect. But these plants still require sunlight to produce the energy that they need to be healthy and to grow. So, plants get their energy from the sun. Some animals get their energy by only eating plants. They're called herbivores. Other animals get their energy by eating other animals and are called carnivores. Some animals, like humans, eat both. They're called omnivores. It's time for Food Chain Fun. Can you figure out the food chain order? We have a dandelion, an ant, and potato the chicken. What eats what? You got, got it. it! The dandelion is at the bottom. The ant eats the dandelion. And potato eats the ant. Well, she does eat dandelion sometimes too. Okay, one more. Grass, a snake, an eagle, and a mouse. That's right, the eagle does eat snakes. But even though the snake doesn't eat grass, it eats animals who eat grass. In that game of rock, paper, scissors, I'll take eagle. I'm glad I put on that sunscreen, otherwise my neck would be really burnt. You're right, Potato. That is the answer to our riddle. What does a sunburn have to do with an eagle? The same sunlight that gives you a sunburn also gets turned into food energy that goes through the food chain to animals like eagles. Challenge time! We challenge you to harness the sun and make some fruit leather. Use a blender to turn fruit into a puree. Cover a baking sheet with parchment paper and pour the pureed fruit in a thin layer. Cover it with a screen to keep bugs off. Leave it out under the sun, bring it inside at night. Do that for a few days until it gets completely dry. You'll know it's done if you poke the center and it's not sticky. Then you can peel it off the baking sheet. Now you have a tasty snack made with the power of the sun. Mmm, -hmm. delicious. For lots of other fun and games and riddles, visit, visit clearwaterkids.org. Challenge yourself to connect to nature and build a healthier world for yourself, for the earth, and for potato.